What is good, everybody? Welcome back to another My Name Toys video. Today, we are back yet again with a beautiful, excellent WWE slash AEW action figure toy hunt, or I guess that's what we're going to be looking for. You know, you never know what you're going to come across on the hunt, but I figured that we could hit a couple stores. One in particular is Dirt Cheap. I don't know if you guys have ever been to a Dirt Cheap or heard of a Dirt Cheap, but basically, it's your typical kind of raw style store where you go in there and they have really good stuff or really high quality stuff for cheaper and they mark it down half price. You know, they basically get the extras or the things that Walmarts and Targets and things like that throw out. They buy it for really cheap and then flip it or, or vice versa. They buy their stock and then flip it. Things of that nature. That's usually how it goes. And so that's where we're probably going to be going as well. But I did also want to go to Target or something like that. Do some other things. But yeah, man, you know we're always on the hunt for AEW chases. You know, I've seen where the Fiend Ultimate Edition has hit a couple places. Maybe ours will as well. But I'll see you guys on the hunt. We're going to get in the car, go to the places, see what we can find. And hopefully we find some good stuff. And I'll meet you back here to see what we picked up. Alright guys, here we are. We got pretty cool Bebop and Rocksteady set. You know, I don't really collect these figures, but still pretty cool to see in person. And that one's actually upside down, which is kind of crazy, but moving over here, this is what I thought was insane. Look at this right here. Three Defender Strange figures. Three Defender Stranges. I think you have to get this, right? I mean, I feel like you have to get it for the portal piece. There's another Bebop Rocksteady 2-pack. Just never got into the line, you know? Just wasn't a big Turtles guy. But the Defender Strange, I feel like at this price, they're already marked like half off practically, and then they're going to be marked half off again. I feel like you almost have to pull the trigger, you know? So we'll see about that. But the thing about coming to Dirt Cheap is you have to dig, man. You got to go up under the aisles. You got to do the dirty work. You got to search out a little bit. But I'm not seeing a ton of stuff. There is a whole nother toy section that I'm going to have to go through. But this place hasn't had anything for months. And to see the, you know, the Defender Stranges, to see some other stuff that's new. Or not necessarily, I guess, brand new. But just to see some different stuff at retail or at Dirt Cheap is a pretty big W, you know, that's, I mean, that's a win in itself, so, okay, we got a little something, something, nice little Owen Wilson, I think I'm still gonna wait on it, I, I, I don't think it's 50% off just yet, so, I think it's gonna be 30% off everything we purchase, so, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to get crazy, but, not much else, you know. I'm not, I'm not seeing a whole lot of other stuff, but we will we will see. But the three Defender Strangers was crazy. You know, you get three of those effect pieces. I mean, that's about it right there. But I'm going to go to the other side of the store and see. And I will let you guys know what we find. So coming over to the other side, there's actually a little bit of stuff over here. But I did see these legends I wanted to look at real quick. It looks like we have a rogue. And we have an Eternal. Now, I don't care about the Eternals, but this is what I really wanted to look at right here to show you guys. We have this a lot of Drew McIntyres, bro. Look at this. Top picks Drew McIntyre. WWE Championship. Not much else going on with it, but six of those. That's insane. Didn't expect to see this. If it was the new Drew McIntyre, you'd have a deal. I'd probably buy all of them. The double jointed arms and stuff, but I don't see, you know, that cycle. $24.99. Again, it's going to be about 30% off, I think, which is, it is what it is, you know, but at the same time, the Drew McIntyre's, I would pick those up if they had, you know, the double joint arms and stuff. Friends Lego set, don't really need. Thought about getting it and doing it with my wife there, but I don't know, we're on the fence about that. It's like over a thousand pieces, which is insane, but oh my good God in heaven, we have a Hurricane Legends figure. It's beat to hell, but I'm going to open it anyway. That's double-jointed arms, bro. That is double-jointed black sleeve arms. I think you got to cop that. I think that's a... you gotta you got to go ahead and grab that. We have more Bat Cycles back here. Missing figure. Now we know why it's here. But multiple Bat Cycles back here. I think I got mine on, on clearance at Target. So it's crazy to see those still continuing. I think I got that over a year ago. And it still continues to hit... I guess technically a lot of this stuff's pretty old. Those top pick Drews are very old, but that's kind of the, you know, that's the games you play when you come here. There's probably more stuff under. I just don't want to dig through it all, you know, but not bad at all. Not bad little stuff at all. I don't see anything else, though, you know. Two WWE Elites, though, they haven't had those Elites in forever. A little Pokemon set. 
they haven't had elites in a, a quite a while so it's cool to just see some new stuff at this dirt cheap but a little gray digger I think that's it all right guys so I'm actually voicing over this part this is actually a bunch of hurricanes that we found so it's pretty insane to find all these hurricanes just stacked up but the music was just entirely too loud to not voice over it and I it's definitely gonna get copyright claim so I went ahead and jumped over it but we found all these hurricanes right here absolutely insane and you guys will know what we did with these if we grabbed them or not but I thought it was pretty cool to see all these hurricanes because I was just thinking either two days ago or whatever that I needed a lot of this hurricane so there you go all right guys here at Target we do have a hit ultimate edition fiend seeing ultimate edition fiend pretty crazy got a couple of ultimate edition fiends and we have two alexa blisses which is pretty cool to see we do have a road dog we have me mark a couple of those four chinas you guys know poor, poor china she's gonna be here a while got the rock got macho man drew mcintyre three anna jays these have been here for a little bit now two rays two rocks then we have two sheetas of course those have been here for ages and we have the two battle packs not a lot of stuff going on and besides the fiend of course which is cool a guy right before me actually grabbed a brody lee i saw him walking off with it don't really need that you know I, it's cool that that guy got a brody lee but we do have the fiend which is a cool grab nice to see that i'll probably grab two of the i might i might grab both we'll see let's go ahead and venture around i don't know if they have anything else i know that they have some marvel legends on the end caps but they don't have anything on the shelves. We also have the windowless packaging. It's been here a little bit now. Oh, snap. I kind of, you know, a little uh, web shooter. The OG was the best one, though, from 02. Probably the best one. But 20 years later, still, still here. Some things never change, you know. But I'm ready for the new stock of Marvel Legends. And I think that's about it, man. I think I'm going to grab my fiends. Alright guys, we're back home after the toy hunt, and god, this lighting is just ishy. However, let's show you guys what we grabbed. We actually grabbed a lot of stuff, and it's kind of it's kind of insane, to be honest with you. It's kind of overwhelming. Let's get into it. So if you guys were unaware, my Target was actually having a huge clearance sale on all their Marvel Legends, and I guess it's because they're expecting new stock and stuff like that, so they're trying to clear out the old stock. And you guys know that Doctor Strange Wave has just been warming shelves everywhere, so I figured it was time to cash in, you know? I, if you can get 50% off, why are you not going to cash in on that? Figured, you know, it could drop a little bit lower you know they're still full price on amazon things of that nature so i was like you know what i'm just gonna bite the bullet on it but let's get into everything that we picked up so we did grab some of the multiverse of madness figures i've yet to see the movie still i have not had an opportunity i got sick wanted to see it multiple occasions i will see it this week i'm going to see it this week so we'll see what comes of that but i did go ahead and pick up mordo i got mordo right here am i gonna pay full price for these absolutely not but i figured if, if i'm going to get these now would be the opportunity to do so when they're this price you know you're just not gonna pass up on that so we did get Mordo. same time we did get wong as well thought this figure has looked so good but i just haven't seen a reason to pull the trigger but now this is the perfect opportunity again man i did actually end up getting two of the america chavez figures one of these is going to be a custom so i wanted to have the gear I, I like the street attire right there gonna do something with that and then of course you do want to have one that's regular or, or one for the collection so again when you get those a really good price why, why not just go ahead and cash in gotta cash in your money in the bank contract sometimes also at target we also grabbed dr strange so i finally picked up this version of dr strange i think it's the best dr strange they've made to date out of every single dr strange they've made i know we did just recently get one and, and things of that nature but i thought this is probably the best one to date so far and I, I like this so we're gonna go with that happy to get all the i think i got them all for like 10 11 bucks so i mean I'm, I'm not gonna beat that right there they probably wouldn't have dropped much lower than that anyways and last but not least at target i went ahead and grabbed the fiend so i did get the fiend beautiful looking figure i needed one minute on card and this one actually is in pretty decent shape there so i always find on the ultimate editions this part right here is always the worst part that little tuck in right there if that is a clean tuck if it's a clean tuck in there i go ahead and grab it so i, I think that that's pretty good right there i don't see a, a lot of damage if any so this is going to go good in the mock ultimate edition set i do have my loose set of course we did a review on the channel if you guys missed all that on that definitely go check it out i did get two so we got two ultimate edition fiends here looking pretty good grabbed a second one now outside of the fiend that goes it for 
our target haul. Now we have our dirt cheap haul, which blew my mind, honestly. You guys saw that we did find the Defender Strange, and these were also, I think, they were either 30 or 50% off, and the marked price was $21.99, which means it was 30 or 50% off that price. So we ended up getting a really good deal on these. You're probably wondering why Gripe 3, it's for the, for the effect piece. I mean, good God, you're not gonna beat that effect piece, man. You can use that in multiple displays across many films and things of that nature, and I figured, what a better way. Use that right there. It's gonna look terrific. I think that's excellent to have that portal effect there, and that's gonna be awesome. So we did get not one, but three of the Defender Strange, so I'm excited for that one. Huge Multiverse of Madness haul. When you can get all of the, I mean, I got three of these, plus all the rest of the figures that we got for maybe right at 100 bucks, maybe. So all three of those are, are terrific. I, I like that. You know, don't ask me what I'm gonna do with three of those figures. Maybe I can, I don't know what I'll do with the other two extras, but I did want the effect pieces, and that's really the main source that we wanted there. And then outside of those, I bought all those hurricanes. Yes, I did. I sure did, Brad. I bought all five hurricanes. So we got one, two, three, four, and five. So, it's because they have double jointed arms that have sleeves. They're sleeve double jointed arms. They're sleeve double jointed arms. You know what this means? I can take these sleeved arms that are double jointed, I can put them on my Jeff Hardys. I can put them on my Finn Balors. I can put them on any guy. I can put them on Kofi Kingston. I can put them on anybody who wears a sleeve. Double jointed arms now. And I have I have a couple cool ideas for Hurricane. I can make some fix of Hurricanes. I could, I, I could use the knee pads. I could use the head sculpts. Again, they're a really good price. They're a really good price. You're going to go ahead and cash in. You got to cash in the money in the bank briefcase right there when you come across these crazy deals i thought it was i thought it's that's a success for me lots of figures right here i think for everything that we showed here today not to mention so i got another loose ultimate batista this one's definitely not meant on card it's beat to hell multiple dents multiple damage but that's another ultimate batista right there so that's that's money so we got another ultimate edition batista to go along with the the rest of our crazy haul here today so i'm i'm all excited about that anyways man that's gonna wrap up our toy hunt video those six drew mcintyre elites didn't see the reason now, if those had been Elite 89 Drew, or had they been the new Top Picks Drew, or the new Drew McIntyre double jointed arms, nice head sculpt, sword accessory, all that, would have been absolutely worth the grab. Now, I know you're probably thinking I could have used the WWE Championships and done something with the Drew McIntyres. I just didn't feel like it was the right time to do that. Maybe I can go back at a later date. Maybe they'll be even cheaper. Maybe uh, somehow somehow they'll drop in price or something like that, and then I can get in on the Drews. I just don't know what I would do with extra Drews that have single jointed arms when I already have that drew and i think i have two of that drew anyway so i don't think i want to get six more copies of that drew six wwe championships i mean i guess i could purchase the drews and then sell the drew figures for five ten bucks a piece but and then keep the wwe titles or or flip the titles i don't know but you guys get the point but it was a very fun day of hunting we got some good stuff in found some amazing deals just incredible deals right there for everything that we got here today man but i'm getting out of here thank you guys so very much for watching i hope you guys did enjoy let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below what would you have grabbed guy right before me at Target actually grabbed a Brody Lee. Don't think I would have purchased a Brody Lee anyways, but glad that guy got a Brody Lee. Those Anna J's have been there forever. The stock hasn't really changed except for the fiends there, so there is that. But thank you guys for watching. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. And uh, yeah, gotta, gotta cash in your money in the bank briefcase, man. If you don't cash in your money in the bank briefcase... <laughs>